10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Lift off. Lift off. The vehicle has cleared the pad, safing launch pad. Stage one propulsion nominal. Approaching max Q. Cleared max Q. Miko confirmed. Stage separation successful. Cleared max Q. Altitude 7, 7 kilometers. Speed of 2,082 meters per second. Stage 2, mission confirmed. And there we go. We have confirmed a successful transition from the first to second stages of Electron's flight with Miko, stage separation, and second stage engine start all nominal. You can now see the orange glow of the space-optimised Rutherford engine as it carries on into space. The payload fairing, the protective shell at the top of Electron, protects the satellites, but since we've cleared the lower atmosphere, they don't need this protection anymore. Let's keep an eye out for when the payload Hello. fairing, Hello. and Hello. there it goes, to so get rid of all that dead weight, and Stage we've seen it just fall away. Now. That stage one booster is doing well on its way back to Earth and stage two is making light work of its journey to orbit. You can see on the graphs there, stage one has, looks like, just reached apogee and is starting its descent back to Earth and stage two is well on its way. Electron's second stage moving at a speed of 11,000 kilometres an hour and just passing through 192 kilometres in altitude. Hot swap successful. And there goes the call for a successful battery hot swap. Listening out now for confirmation of the deployment of the drogue chute battery on stage one. Confirmed. That'll bring the initial stage velocity of the booster down to about a third from around Mark 1.4 to just Mark 0 0.5. Recovery vessel confirms drogue. Stage one main chute deployed and confirmed on video. Meanwhile, in space, where that stage two is ferrying our customer spacecraft to their orbital destination, we're moving at a very brisk 28,000 kilometres an hour, and it looks like we've just had stage two shutdown. Stage three is Nominal transfer orbit achieved. Confirm splashdown of stage one. For those of you just joining us there, we have had stage one splashdown in the Pacific Ocean. And you can see it on your screen just there. We're with the crew aboard the recovery vessel who will now be making their way to the splashdown location to collect their booster.